At one point, you think Emily is becoming meaner because she's hanging out with Tamara? Yeah, that's what I thought. I did. I really did. Gina said before her dinner that you were so far up Tamara's ass that you were becoming maybe more aggressive as you hang out with uh, Tamara or meaner. What the f is up with Emily? She's lodged up Tamara's ass. I don't like the accusation that someone else controls the way I act or the way I think. I consider myself to be 48 and educated and confident. And so anything I do or say, I own. And if I'm wrong, I apologize. And I don't think I act any differently around Tamara. I do like Tamara. I enjoy her. We spend a lot of time together. I'm glad we're friends. I'm glad we are too. Really Cheers. Cheers to that, you devil bitch. <laughs> I think Emily jokes around a lot and it's part of her you know, uh, covering of emotions is to make jokes and sometimes they get mean. I mean, I just watched episode four and I think I, when I watched Emily and Tamara together, uh, I, yeah, I, it was very hard for me to watch. That's why I like Big Bear. There's no paparazzi there. No, and but I, I have a number you can call if you would like to tell them that you'll be in Big Bear. No, All I'm right. good. I'm used to Tamara hating Emily. You know, and I hated that. I hated that. Block her from social media. She tries to reach out to you. She doesn't get any responses. She said that you called her Shrek. I mean, you make fun of me. I've never called you Shrek, and I don't make fun of you. But then it was like Tamara was just loving her a little too much. And do you love me? How much do you love me? This much. Oh my God. Listen, oh my God. Oh my God. Don't drop me. There was some stuff going on that I think maybe was their way of bonding, but it was coming across as a little bit mean. That accusation really pissed me off, obviously. What happened? What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? Nothing. Because it's, I, I've always been the same way. I don't think I was any meaner or any different. I've always been like that. I'm not doing this on a FaceTime. I'm not gonna do it tonight. Have fun at your party. We even got together again. No, I'm not, I'm not doing this on a FaceTime. No, no, I'm not doing it. I just wanted to kind of pull her out of there, you know? Get her, just get, get some oxygen, come over here. We only need one camera. We don't need to. That's my opinion! I am gonna watch me and Gina arguing. I have not seen it since I lived it. So let's see what my reaction is. I feel betrayed by you and I'm having a really hard time. I felt stabbed in the back. I understand that you're hurt. I get it that you're not gonna get over it and that's fine, but I need you to know that I'm really your friend. I made a mistake. I did trust someone that perhaps I shouldn't have trusted. And now I am trying to sort that out. I know why Katie has a different timeline. It's because she's lying. Why would I come into this group just lying? And Good I question. Don't know. It was 10 minutes or two days. It was not 10 minutes. It was not one day. It was not even two days. But I know it wasn't a month. It was weeks. I'm not Alexis. I don't bring bank statements. Okay, let's move on. Tonight, we're gonna put you on OnlyFans. I know. I can't What'd wait. you say? Damn it! I can't eat this pasta. I gotta get naked later. Check, please. <laughs> Tell you what, I'm gonna believe you, and I'm gonna give you the benefit of the doubt, and I'm going to try and move past this. I don't really need the big apology. I need the actions, so ever. There's no point in going over this again and again and again. I'm just gonna have to wait and see what happens. And I never wanna hear the word paparazzi again. Ever. I mean, it plays exactly how I remember it, which is good. You want things to look exactly like you remember them. It was tough, I love Gina, but it was, that was tough for her to have just believed this girl that she didn't even know and didn't even ask for the proof and there was no proof. And that was tough to see from a friend. When Gina told me that her knee-jerk reaction to getting information about me that could potentially be bad was elation, happiness, laughing. Do you have proof of that? I have a screenshot of it. That is so messed up. For Gina to encourage someone to bring information about me into the group. Like, because I'm friends with Heather, 
I want you to have an opportunity to talk to her and I think that's the right thing for you to do. Right. That is such a betrayal. And why wouldn't you tell me? I thought it was in the best interest of everybody to let that go and to never bring that up. And that was the decision that I made. I wish you had said something. Yeah, no, I know, I f***ed up. And why would you have me advocate for this girl to come on the show, which I did, when you know she's got a vendetta against me? Nice to meet you. Yeah, he says great things about you. I adore her. I've met Heather before, very briefly, but this is the first time that she's said hello back. Jean and I have been friends for a few years and I care about her a lot and I know she's going through a lot right now with Travis and what's going on, you know, with the families and everything. And I don't like how all this went down, but because we have this basis of friendship, obviously I'm not going to throw her away. I will move on and hope that nothing like this ever happens again. Any new real estate career updates. And since Altman and Tracy from Million Dollar Listing also sell in the OC, have you ever worked with them? And if not, would you like to? I have not worked with um, Tracy or Josh Altman. I am open to working with anyone. I respect the other agents. I like working with the other agents. So if we did cross pads, that would be amazing. I have been seeing their listings pop up. So trust me, if I have a buyer for one of their listings, that's a great day for me. Yeah, <laughs> baby. $55 million isn't you money. It's everybody you've ever known money. <laughs> um, but no, I have not crossed that. They're mostly on the coast, you know, selling on the coast. And I'm more selling more inland. Oh, this is beautiful. Thank you, my, my, my three-year remodel. Oh, wow, look at the kitchen. Shannon, but yes. wait till you see all the rest. I can't wait. There's three rooms down this hallway. That's the master, right? Primary. This is worth the price it's tag. It's so wow. amazing. Isn't it nice? Oh, it's so pretty. So peaceful. Oh. So far, we haven't crossed paths. <laughs>